Hey everyone, welcome back. This is TUK. So today I wanted to cover some Yu-Gi-Oh news for the Japanese side. We have the entirety of the Prismatic Art Collection set. This set comes out officially tomorrow. Each booster box will come with 15 packs and each pack comes with 4 cards. It's around $3 per pack. This is the entire set. Let's see the cards here that's gonna be a Prismatic Secret Rare for those who want to collect this set because this does not have any new cards. Like it's only a reprint set, okay? So let's just try to cover them here. So we have the three god cards in these artwork the these two from the movie artwork and the newest uh, raw artwork uh, in prismatic personally i don't like this art for our uh, for artwork for raw or uh, slifer but i like this one for obelisk so these are three prismatic i feel like these are going to be chase cards in this set for collectors we have those artwork for main characters uh, ace monsters they already got so these are just reprint for them in rare forms this is not a prismatic secret rares these two are prismatic alternate art for karibo and alternate art for winged karibo yeah these two they look awesome uh, i like uh, winged karibo i would like to get this one we have alt art uh, cyber dragon alt art uh, cyber end dragon so yeah both are great next uh, these are two C prismatic secret rare as well so we have all the ghost, sist ghost sisters and the newest one down here uh, but all of them are in prismatic in the old art we got from dual overload we have here tour guide in regular rare we have dark magician the dragon knight we just got this again in just regular rare here or ultra rare maybe so we have cyber dragon infinity old art kagari in prismatic okay we have levioneer regular uh, Firewall Dragon regular, Phantasme regular, Droll and Lockbird regular, Stratos. I'm not a fan of this art for Stratos, Stratos to be honest. Like, I I'm a elemental hero person. I am. It's my favorite deck when I used to play Yu-Gi-Oh. So this is, I'm not a fan of this artwork. It's not bad, but I I'm not a fan of it. So Appaloosa in regular, Coral Sword in regular. I hate this artwork. Alistair. We just got these in the premium gold so yeah so we have two new amazing cards here first of all the new art for red eyes so yeah this artwork for red eyes i think this is going to be a really really expensive card because it's a new artwork okay same for the destiny hero plasma this artwork is amazing i really love this artwork even more than the old not of course the old one is nostalgic for me but this is still really really amazing artwork so yeah i think this is going to be expensive in this set Next we have the Light Charmer, all of these are prismatic. IP Mascarena, really amazing artwork. I really really wish the they show the artist down here or something like other card games so that we know who drew this because it's really amazing artwork. So yeah, IP Mascarena, really amazing artwork. Uh, I don't know when we will get this but it's a really really amazing artwork. We have the Ghost Shell and Moonlit, prismatic, so these all prismatic. We have Terraforming, non-prismatic, E-Call. Uh, Italy, trade in, tuning, seed change tactics, red eyes fusion, all of these in prismatic. Really staple cards, really gonna be chased if you're gonna max out on these to play three of each. Of course, Italy for us is uh, limited. But yeah, all of these are really, really good. Prismatic uh, reprints for players as well. So next is Invocation, non prismatic. Dealist Alliance, prismatic. The Anchor, prismatic. Bingo Machine, Gogo, -Go, and Sinus Mining, all of these are prismatic. Really good reprints as well for those decks. Like, I don't like Bingo Machine, Gogo -Go that much, but it's a good reprint. The next is Destiny Fusion, Destiny Fusion, non prismatic, and Starlight Road, non prismatic. Okay. And last thing is uh, Magician Navigation in prismatic. This is gonna be Chase card as well for those who play Dark Magician. So, yeah, this is the entirety of the set. It's a small set, 50 cards set. Uh, so, the rarities here are Prismatic Secret Rare, Secret Rare, Ultra Rare, Super Rare, or Normal Rare. So all of these are really good. So I think this set is good for collectors. Here's the entirety of this set here. It's only 50 card set, so it's not that big. So I would suggest go ahead and buy boxes for those who like to collect. Go ahead, buy it. Because usually these type of product, they printed it once and they stopped printing it again. Yeah, for those who like collecting, I would suggest go ahead because I think this card's gonna be expensive, same as all of these uh, god cards, so yeah. Thank you for watching, if you liked the video, make sure to like it, share it, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.